Um, the, uh, I'm, I can see now on my screen that we might be able to bring in uh, our, our, our participant from Israel. Uh, yeah, look at that. I do see something great. Excellent. I'm really happy about that. Uh, just just to tell, tell you guys, I'm wearing my, my headphones. Maybe this is for the technical crew because the monitors, it makes it very difficult for me to understand what people at the other end, even right, you know, next to me are saying. So I'm just wearing this for my own benefit. Thank you very much. Um, now, Itamar Rabinovich, can you hear me? Yes, I can. Excellent. Oh, can you hear me? We can, and we're so glad that you're with us because your voice in this conversation is essential. Uh, can you tell us where you're joining us from? We can see you're in a, in a vehicle. Uh, I am in a vehicle. We had some understanding about the panel, so I'm not at my home as I plan to be. I'm in my car, but speaking on my phone, but here I am, anyway, and uh, delighted to be with you. Excellent. We can see and hear you very well, and it's just fine that you're in that car. We're, we're very glad that you can join us today. Um, would, would you like to offer a few comments? We've just been getting underway. I did an introduction uh, of our guests, including yourself, on, uh, with the hope that you would be joining us. And um, we've heard from a couple of speakers so far. We've touched on some of the themes. Uh, you know, we've been in email contact with one another, so uh, we're staying pretty much on track with what we discussed. Uh, would you like to uh, offer some comments to the plenary at this point over the next couple of minutes and then before we move on to the next speaker? Yes, yes. I think that we need to look at uh, so-called the day, the day after. The day after, we must have a vision of where where we want to take the region and the Arab-Israeli relationship to, um, which means dealing with the, the uh, larger Palestinian question in the Israeli relationship with the Palestinian Authority and the I I heard the, the reference of before to the West against the rest. It doesn't have to be that. Um, I think there are several countries in the Middle East that do not see the problem with the West, but see the problem with Iran. Uh, our host itself, Saudi Arabia and others have been the targets of violence by proxies of Iran. I see that the current war is not just a war between Israel and Hamas, but between Israel and Israel is targeted or threatened by five Iranian proxies. And in order to organize the region to deal with these issues, there will have to be a plan for dealing with the Israeli-Palestinian relationship. It's difficult to envisage it. We're in the middle of a war. We have the wrong government, the wrong Israeli government for, for doing that, but the need is there. Uh, the debate inside Israel today is do you deal with the uh, political issues domestically in the middle of a war, or do you wait for the end of the war, whatever that end may be. But I hope that at the end of it there will be a government in Israel that would be willing to look at the larger picture and to fit into a scheme that would help organize the region, including dealing with the larger Palestinian question. Thank you very much. Uh, do, if you don't have anything to add, we'll move along. Um, that sounds, um, it didn't take you very long to get to Iran and Iran's proxies, uh, the role that they're playing in this, in this war. I think that's an, an, a hugely important part of this, of course. We need to discuss that. It's also important what you mentioned about the political uh, context within Israel itself and the uh, ability of the Israeli government or willingness of it to uh, to address this problem in a constructive way. These are question marks uh, that you've raised. Thank you. Thank you for now. Did you, if you don't have anything else to add, I don't want to interrupt you. You're very well. Okay. Um, our, our, our connection seems to be stable. I hope it will stay that way. Uh, so we'll continue then here on, on the panel bringing in voices. Uh